Yeah, what is going on guys? My MJ2K Mossbox K King Marks we're back with this video and uh hey man Listen y'all we just got to reacting to I was gonna I was gonna react to uh I mean I already know that I already reacted to um uh the Boruto versus Kawaki trailer thing was hype. If you guys didn't see that reaction video, check it out. We lit. But uh, yeah, man, I was looking. Yeah, I yeah, but I want to see like what my what, what this guy say about him. I'm definitely curious what he has to say about it and everything. It's gonna be. I think he's gonna like, break it down the tra the trailer. This my uh, his name is. Let's check out his name. Naruto explained. So I'm pretty sure he's about to give us a quick rundown of how everything's about to be and everything. So I'm definitely curious what he has to say about it. Um. Maybe he'll tell us some stuff from the manga, cause I, like I said, I'm kind of like I'm I'm that I have to been reading the manga. I'm I am behind in the manga though, but it is tough. I do know how amazing the manga is. I am really aware of it. I just need to catch up on it. And on the other hand, uh, your boy tried to watch it. The only good parts is from the, the whole Momoshiki arc and everything, but uh, that's about it really. So we definitely gonna get on with this. I definitely hear what, he, what he, Naruto explain has to say. And uh, yeah, man, <laughs> let's check it out. This intro is tough though. This intro is hard, bro. Yeah, I like these transitions. Too. These transitions are great. Yo, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy Nall to explain here, and yeah. today we have some amazing yeah. news. Up, so, as you can tell from the title, as you can tell from the thumbnail, we have. Goodies from Jump Festa 2021, or I guess 2020, since this is technically 2020, but we have some amazing goodies. So we have for the end of the Vessel arc, and that's going to jump us off into the Kawaki arc, which is the current arc of the Boruto manga. They have some amazing animation in this trailer. Yes, they Kawaki did. Yes, they did. Yes, sir. His anime debut in the timeline, and it does not disappoint. It does not disappoint at all. Now, I'm only going to show you some screenshots yeah, it, from it, the it trailer. Can, they cannot not mess us up, bro. We've been dealing for, with the, really, the, the, the bull cat of the trailer Boruto for a couple too of reasons. long, Number dog. One, copyright strikes. Anytime you start dealing with Jump Festa content, stuff like this, when you start putting in the videos like this, you run a really good risk of a copyright strike. To give you an idea of how big these trailers are, Imagine somebody leaking somebody's Super Bowl commercial. That's the level of stuff that you're getting into right here. That's why I don't mess around with Jump Festa stuff when it's in this regard. So yes, sir. the second yes, sir. reason why I'm that. not going to do something I like that, that is simply for the fact that this is one of those trailers you absolutely need to see it yourself. I, I can't put it into words, but I'm going to go ahead and give you my on it for to if you try to watch the trailer and it's being taken down or whatnot because it hasn't been officially released outside of the official board so uh, twitter account and even then it might get taken down but the trailer starts off where you have boruto and team seven and they're looking at Kawaki, and there's a really nice homage to when Sasuke is looking down at the members of Team 7, the new Team 7, in Orochimaru's hideout. And you have Kawaki where he sees Team 7, he says, Konoha Shinobi. And you get this really nice shot where you see the close up of Kawaki's lips, and then you see. Yeah, I'm chatting behind lips. Kawaki <laughs> making an angry face at Team 7, and then before they can even. They just start rumbling, Kawaki, dog. They realize. Jump. Rumble, but the clip. animation and was freaking amazing, bro. This trailer has movie level animation. You can tell they. I won't go that far. Out the stops and the I don't know. It looked good though. The manga like the close up, the close up of the characters, you, yes, for sure. But there were some parts of the fight. I'm not gonna lie. Done in the anime, some parts look. Some parts look. Man, look, look good. Some parts look like uh, I don't know about, but, but but when the close ups, when it came down to the close ups of them fighting and everything. So we body of everything. Yo, it looked freaking amazing, bro. It looked freaking good. I love the close-up on Kawaki and everything. Boruto. Yeah, that stuff like that. I love the, um, the, there was, like, when it kind of came to the long range, like, they were, like, kind of, the camera kind of backed away from them, those two fighting. I'm not gonna lie. I was like, eh, it was all right. It was all right. It looked kind of, like, stiff in a little bit. But, bro, once it came down to the close-ups, show those two fighting, going head-to-head -head with each other, yo, 
my dog. It looks pretty clean, man. I'm not even gonna hold you. Things to make this fight definitely pop off. What's so beautiful about this? Kawaki charges full steam ahead, and you get this really beautiful sequence where yeah, that's, that's Kawaki one of the cool stuff. Yeah, bro. Kawaki's hand, bro. That was freaking to tough. You see how Kawaki, the fluidity of his movements as he's stretching forward and he shoots out one of these huge chakra blasts. You see the members of Team 7 immediately disperse to get out of the way. And the only one who is charging forward is Boruto. Boruto yeah, I know. Hey, I, I noticed that. Oh, the rest of the just held back, dog. Hand. It's a chakra blade. And the beautiful thing about that is we see something that so many people wanted to see for such a long time, which is you see Boruto and Kawaki exchanging in a miniature sword. Kawaki's arm, yeah, this is kind of like the scenes I didn't use. Like, eh, kind of like kind of sticks on the side bit. coming out of his forearm. And you see Boruto and Kawaki, they immediately, they lock, they lock swords and then they break apart and then they charge each other. And you just see this beautiful back and forth, this beautiful sword dance that is going on where Boruto's jumping underneath I, I wasn't really a huge fan of this scene. I felt like it was kind of stiff a little bit, but other than that, like it Boruto's looks really great one of the attacks. Boruto's dodging down. Yeah, like this right here was spinning. nice. This scene right Kawaki here was beautiful. Kawaki gets Boruto on a defensive, and you get this really beautiful shot of where, as Boruto is backing up, Kawaki, his blade ends up getting Boruto on the side. Oh, look how clean the animation And then up. you get another beautiful shot of a close-up of Boruto and Kawaki as they're looking face to face at each other and Kawaki has this stern expression on his face and then you get another amazing shot where as they begin to back up the trailer begins to show you smaller moments and this is how we know that the Kawaki arc in the manga the current arc right now yep. that you anime only fans have heard people such as myself say when the anime gets a hold to this material Yo. it starts adapting and adding on Yo, I can't it's wait to, um, immediately pick up in terms of tone well, yes you're seeing it here this trailer is a glimpse of what is to come and you get this beautiful shot of the vase that kawaki has a huge connection to i know you're like it's a vase what's so important about it? i don't want to go into spoilers but that vase has a connection with kawaki and another character who's going to be central to kawaki's story i love that shot right there and then you get another really brilliant shot where you have these chakra blasts coming at Kawaki. Kawaki, his karma seal begins to activate and it begins to spread yeah, across saw his that. body. Yeah, we saw that Kawaki in the trailer too. Kawaki absorbs the actual chakra blast and then you see another shot of Kawaki with his karma seal is yeah, spreading yo, across I his saw eye. That, bro. And I the was beautiful tough, thing about tough. that is we're seeing karma fully activated for the first time in animated fashion. We yes. saw it in the flash yeah, horror sequence in good. Boruto episode 1 but that was only for about 30 seconds but for this it's so smooth the way that it's traveling up his arm and making its way up to his face and you just see the progression right there and everybody finna skip yo manga, everybody finna skip you know all the other episodes from boards so just, just to see kawaki i already know everybody gonna be stupid all the episodes very important but i'm glad that they left that out it's just enough to get the appetite wet for and i don't know bro this i ain't gonna uh, <laughs> go say i'm gonna be doing i mean i ain't gonna say that either i might dog i played some of the opening for the upcoming Boruto anime uh you're gonna get a new opening song and sequence and everything okay uh, new the opening date, i did not get down the with date. that i am not gonna play the uh actual audio for the song simply for the fact that again copyright even though it would technically fall under fair use those of you guys who are not content creators do not realize how big of a pain in the ass sony music japan is to deal with and you do not realize how big of a pain in the ass tv tokyo is to give you guys an example my uh rennie sharingan explain video i had to literally re-edit parts of the video because I was at risk of getting a copyright strike, and I found out when I upload the video. Again, it's fair use, but Japan has a whole different. Set it's of a whole balls different ball game to. up in Japan, they have dog. Fair it really use is. Over there, whole different type of ball They don't acknowledge games. it on stuff like here on YouTube. I would love to be able to do actual breakdown, scene by scene, frame by frame, like that. But I've seen it with other channels where other channels have been shut down, even though it's fair use, and I refuse to take that uh, risk. I refuse to go through something like that ever again. I lost the channel before. I refuse to go through it again. That's why you guys don't see me use too many manga panels or too many actual clips and screenshots on the actual episodes when I right. do the reviews. 
simple. Hey man, I get it, dog. I mean, listen. I've had to deal with situation in the past. That's why I stopped kind of reacting to anime reactions. That's why I kind of stopped doing anime reactions because, like, you get lucky I don't want to get with copyright strike, bro. Right? Or copyright really claim. I never got like a copyright strike, but I always get like a copyright claim. Like I said, I've lost a channel, and I know from private conversations that I've had with channels that are much bigger than mine, five times bigger than my channel. If they would have had to go through the idea where they lost a channel and had to start over from zero, they just would have quit YouTube altogether. I'm really hoping you guys understand where I'm coming from. Oh yeah, for sure, Naruto. I would Naruto. love to Real be able to do stuff with anime Real, clips. I get the way it, man. That that's why I constantly I'm awesome taking a break from anime reactions. This was like my that was my first anime like reaction that I uploaded since freaking like what? But Shueisha, uh, okay, TV Tokyo, that was like a trailer for you. It's been a minute since I reacted to it. So anime. The content ID system over here on YouTube, and we don't have any type of protection. It's so much more creatively that I want to do over here on YouTube, and that I want my editors to be able to do. But bring it in because again losing a channel is one hell of a heartbreaking experience so heck, let me know yeah, heck, which heck, 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 fight yeah. you guys want to see get extra filler added to it when the boards of anime gets to the kawaki arc what fight are you most looking forward to but so always guys if you like anything i had to say don't forget to comment rate subscribe and share thank you so much for watching to the end have an awesome day guys hey man shout out to not to explain bro good video I uh, like I said, man. I'm, we all looking. We are all looking forward to uh, the Kawaki arc or whatever you want to call the Kara arc, man. We're all looking forward to see Kawaki in action, anime form. Um, like you know, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. I'm, I, I might actually end up reacting to some Boruto, maybe. We'll see what happens with that. And um, but yeah, man. But anyway, that's all I got for today, guys. I'll see you guys in my next video. You guys stay safe, stay fresh. With MJH1, AK Maj Marks, AK King Marcus, and I'm my brother, the anime bad boy. Out this bitch. Buzzy.